All right, guys, so we've now traveled from West London over to Northwest London. Second vehicle up today is a car that I have to say is very close to my heart. A BMW E46 330i convertible. I am 31 now. 10 years ago when I was 21, I used to own one of these in blue and I absolutely love the car. Obviously, technology and performance has moved on a lot over the last 10 years, but 10 years ago, this was a pretty quick car, especially for a 21 year old. And as I say, I absolutely loved it. Um, these cars are becoming rarer and rarer, certainly in terms of what we see coming uh, to us as a business for minor cosmetics. A lot of people, they just simply don't get repairs done on these types of vehicles because they're a little bit older and they're aging. But this particular model is quite a low mileage example. I think it's around 50,000 miles on the clock and um, really, really nice. If you haven't by now seen the interior, we'll overlay some images or a video of this one's interior. Really like it. Anyway, we are here to repair a bumper scuff. It's gonna be a pretty quick process. I'm sure you've seen many, many bumper scuffs up until now. So uh, we thought we'd throw this one in today as you're with us all day today. So let's get into the repair. As far as bumper scuffs go, this was pretty light. It's just about gone through the clear coat, not very deep at all, just down here. Um, so now what we'll do is we'll just key up the rest of the bumper, give that a good clean down, mask up the rest of the car, and we'll be paint painting it in no time. sure if I didn't explain why I haven't taken the area off someone would say why haven't you taken the area off you can't or well, you can but it's basically it's not one of the twist off ones this car has got an upgraded um, some upgraded sound software on it and this isn't the original aerial so rather than try and take it off end up in a situation where I break something or I can't get it back on or who knows do you know what just mask it up so that is why I'm doing that and not just taking it off happy days Put your body on 
So that was a fairly straightforward bump repair. Something I noticed when uh, I was just assessing the damage was that the rear panel looks as though it's been clipped as well. And if you come in here, you'll see that there's a, a bit of a scuff to the clear coat. So what we're gonna try with that is a bit of paint correction, you should know me by now. It's going to be a 10 15 minute job, obviously, not included in the original repair cost. But I'm here, it's not going to take me too far out of my way, and it's nice to be nice. So, let's give that a little bit of paint correction, see if we can remove it without the need for a respray, and then we'll get everything polished up all at the same time. done we've gone green yellow and blue and now remove the final layer of polish and that is another one complete and also rounds off Monday thank god the weather has been grim today but I guess we can't have it sunny every time certainly in the UK but yeah that is it um, a little bit of a longer video for you guys let us know in the comments if you'd like these longer videos or are they better to keep are we better to keep them short and sweet also if you've got any ideas let us know what you want to see in the comments um, what we're conscious of is we don't want to get too repetitive obviously it's a different car a different color um, different repair location somewhere on the vehicle. We try to mix it up as much as possible, but I'm also conscious that we don't want to keep repeating ourselves. So if there is specifics that you might want to see in future videos, be sure to let us know in the comments. We've got a few ideas in mind, and when we hit 3,000 subscribers, we may just switch it up a little bit. So look out for that coming in the future. Let's get this demast all blown off and then we will show you the finished repair.
so there you have another completed repair guys fairly straightforward bumper scuff and a little bit of paint correction to the rear quarter panel and i guess that has rounded off a very wet monday but if you haven't subscribed subscribe and make sure you press the notification bell for plenty more videos to come make sure you've liked this video if you've enjoyed it and follow us on all our platforms including instagram and i guess i will see you on the next one in a few days time